Hi, every. as this woman is getting arrested, okay? Supposedly getting arrested, woman with a tattoo on her arm, which we know is probably a crisis act, yeah? So look top left, who comes? Yeah, that's it. Our friend here. It's a woman, it's a woman, it's a woman. Yeah, thanks for that, mate. Um, so yeah, have a look where he actually comes from, right? He comes from the top left-hand corner there, where the ambulance is, yeah? And as you can see there, Mr. Adidas, who's the one who supposedly had blood dripping down his face, is there as well, okay? So, top left-hand corner, keep your eye there. Top left corner. There we go, right? So he comes from the ambulance over there. What's he doing over there? Yeah? He's obviously there so that people take footage of him, like, confronting the police because they've got a woman there. Um, but what's he doing in the corner? And why has he got a yellow high-vis uh, high vest or jacket in his hand? Look, right, you'll see. He tries to put it in his bag, doesn't have enough time, so he just sort of leaves it to the side of him so it's not too visible. But why did he have that? What's that about? Yeah, and then they supposedly push him away. So one more time. Top left hand corner. Quickly off he comes, trying to hide his high vis vest. It's a woman, it's a woman, it's a puppy. Right, so that's that. So that would be enough, wouldn't it, to suggest there's something weird. But then, um, so we got him here, right? We got him here one day, this time without a top on, looking very <laughs> striking with his mate F. Boris in the background and his mate Mr. Um, Red Nike, yeah? So there's one. Here he is again, right at the front again by the police. His favourite place, right by the police, yeah? There he is again. Perfect for the cameras. Right there. <laughs> right there, yeah? And this was very recently. Very recently, okay? So... Now look at this, yeah. So that is supposedly the weekend, I believe. Yeah, 26, right? So like uh, Trainer Head, who I'm very grateful for showing me this, says, the bro looks very fake. I just think the way it's on the jacket looks very fake. Um, there are hardly any on his bag strap, yeah? If at all. Only by that buckle, but that could have been from that label, yeah? Um, so did he have the bag on before or after? Um, but yeah, to me it just looks very weird. And also, I don't know, I don't know. It's a bit funny, isn't it, that all these people who are getting used over and over again, two of them supposedly get um, beaten up by the police, yeah? But like I said, that's not that long after, really, isn't it? He's not bothered about the fact that he gets hit by the police. It's not a problem. I'm back here. Yeah. And then remember this, right? You know? Right there. Again. Right there again. So, I mean, I don't know how many times you have to see him. Right there. Right by the police. Right in front of uh, the alleged Muslim lady policewoman and here getting pushed by 
Emporo Armani guy in the cap um, getting pushed forward so it starts sort of, you know, looks like melees are going on, but it's not really. Yeah. And then, as I said, that was when he um, confronts the police because they've got a... It's a woman! It's a woman! <laughs> so, yeah, there you go. You see him everywhere, everywhere, everywhere. And then he just happens to be a victim of that. Okay. But to me, that just looks like some weird-ass red paint or something. And what are the chances are that he gets hit just like his mate um, with the overly baggy clothes got supposedly hit as well. And what's funny is, I haven't got it here, but there's a clip where they're bas the police are basically pushing the guy who's with grey hair who's bleeding. They just keep pushing him, pushing him, pushing him. They can tell that he, uh, that you know, he's supposedly bleeding, but they just keep pushing him. So, yeah, to me it's just another indication that there are you know people being reused over and over and over again all right so let me know what you think in the comments everyone do take care of yourselves peace and blessings